brought to you by the Every Dollar app. Start budgeting for free today. Courtney's with us. Courtney is in Colorado Springs. Hi, Courtney. Welcome to the Ramsey Show. Hi, thank you so much for having me. Sure. What's up? My question is, how do I protect or how does my husband and I protect our finances against his money hungry ex wife? <laughs> money hungry ex wife. Why would she have any access to your finances? She's called the ex wife for a reason. Um, basically our main concern is could she pull more child support when she finds out that he's been married? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, would she get child support increased because he got a raise? Is that what you said? Um, because we got married, could she take She doesn't more get more child support has- because you got married. Child support's okay. based on his income, not yours. Gotcha. Okay. So how else would the crazy ex have access to your husband's money? That was the only way I was thinking. I've yeah. heard that they do yearly audits. They do. Someone they do because your husband, your husband has children, and he should support those children. And the law agrees with that idea. Correct. And if he gets more money as his income, he's supposed to give more to his children. That's that's not a money hungry ex. That's just dad taking care of his kids. Right. Yeah. But, Has she contacted him? Is she making threats? Or is this just all kind of in your head right now of what could happen? Um, she hasn't contacted him. I guess this is just me trying to make sure we protect ourselves. Okay. Well, you're in good shape. As long as your husband is willing to give the legal percentage of his income to his children under the law for child support, which he legally and morally should do. Um, mm-hmm. if, the, if you if you want protection from that, I can't help you. But as long as he's willing to do that, you don't need protection from anything else. She can't get anything else. She has no access. And Or if your husband is spineless and just gives her money because she yells at him or something. I mean, has he got that problem? Um, no, she's not. Okay. So he's not, he doesn't just hand her money just because she puffs up or something, right? Correct. Okay. That's just a behavior issue. That's not a legal or a financial issue. But yeah, I mean, sometimes people are intimidated by their exes or whatever. And um, we have to just kind of correct that by saying, you know, X in front is a reason. Yes. X means no mo. No mo. That's what that means. We're making sure the courts decide how this goes down, not his emotions or her. And so that that's the important part. And it sounds like this is largely right now just a fear versus a reality. Yeah, like you have discovered that no one likes your husband's ex. Oh well, that's really you know you you know makes it, two because she's a greedy jerk. Okay, whatever, that's fine, no trouble. Uh, but she's still over there, and she's the ex, and the only involvement you have is just around the children. And so we'll try to be nice and pleasant and give the appropriate amount of child support. Uh, as long as you're trying to do that, then. Uh, I don't think you're going to have any issues. There's nothing, nothing she can just, you know, or unless she shows up at the doorstep and your husband just caves and starts handing her money. But that's a husband issue. That's not a protection issue then. Right? Yeah, this, this was simpler than I thought it would be. I thought there was some crazy stuff going on, but it's just child support as far as we can tell. Yeah. So, yeah. very reasonable. Well, there's a real dynamic when you're the new wife and the ex is over there in the distance crazy. Mm. That's a there's dyna- still a connection that, That's point. a dynamic. Yeah. Those so, kids are still going to be in his life, so... You're going to have to learn to manage it. Yeah, it's a, it's a thing. Create your free every dollar budget today. The simplest way to budget for your life.